What's going on guys? Welcome to episode 23 of our Wolfpack Return to Primetime Dynasty mode. Um, it's episode 23, I think I already said that, but this is the standings uh, before we play the ACC Championship game. Hopefully if we get in after this week. So you can see Texas is number one, Florida State is number two. I don't even know how they're number two after we beat them. Uh, Kansas State is number three, Oregon is number four, Michigan is number five, um... South Carolina is number six. Nebraska is number seven. Arkansas is number eight, and we are number nine. How are we not number three in the nation um, with that record of ours? Same with Washington. How are they not number four? Uh, how is BYU not up there? Um, this is some bull crap. Just based on this is basically just how it is in real life. You have really good teams in Houston. Houston should be up there. Uh, that don't get into the top, uh, the top ten. Or even the top five. Uh, all the teams with one loss should be in the top five. Uh, no doubt about it. And we, we are technically number seven in the BCS. But we are number nine in the coaches poll. Um, so, uh, as you can see, we beat Boston College. Uh, which was a good game. I hope you guys enjoyed that game. I'm actually doing this before I actually chop that up. Um, and record that. Just because this is a whole lot easier for me to do. Uh, just based on uh, everything. So... Um, I don't get why we're not higher. I think we should be higher. We've been playing really, really well. Um, Cougars, we were probably going to face them in the Rose Bowl. Um, I would assume, uh, just based on everything. Uh, I think it was Alabama. Was it Alabama that was at the top uh, beforehand? And I think they lost to Auburn. Uh, conference standings, uh, we are number one on the Atlantic uh, side of uh, the ACC uh, we're 5-0 in the division, 8-0 in the conference. Um, that's pretty good. We're number one in the conference overall, and uh, I'm pretty sure that we will be facing Virginia Tech in the ACC championship game. If we get in, I would not be surprised if we are screwed out of that, just how we are in the standings. Um, they're number 10 in the nation, which is pretty exciting. So it would be number 9 versus number 10 if that happened. Um, but, uh, you know, it's been very, very good. Um this year has been very, very good for the Wolf Pack. I'm, I'm really happy to see it. So this is looking at all the bowl projections, um, all these no-name bowls, really, and then uh, Chick-fil-A Bowl. BCS National Championship is going to be Florida State versus Texas, which I don't agree with. I think we should be in there just based on the fact that we killed uh, Florida State uh, earlier in the year. But as you can see, we're actually uh, in the – projected being the Rose Bowl. Um with Houston, which would be a good game. Um, I don't know how Pittsburgh got into the Orange Bowl. Uh, the, the Sugar Bowl should be good, Kansas State versus Georgia. But um, the Rose Bowl is uh, definitely where we should be, in my opinion. Um, just based, I mean, look at that. This, that should be the championship game. Um, just based on the fact that we're doing really well. You can see we have technically the upper hand in all of our overalls. They actually have more passing yards. They're the fourth. Wow, they're going to be passing against us. They're number four in the nation passing yards. And uh, but we have the number one defense uh, in the in the league, which is exciting. Or sorry, not in the league. Wow, it sounds like mad. In the nation, we have the number one um, defense. So their only loss was against UCLA, but other than that, they were killing everybody. And their only loss was against UConn. Which, if Chuck Mangum hadn't thrown that interception, we would have probably won that game, probably be undefeated, which I have no idea where we would be in the standings if that had happened. Um, but we we won our big games. We killed Florida State 55 nothing. I don't know how we are not in the top because of that. Um, we've been killing everybody since that uh, UConn game, which is exciting. Um, as you can see, they've won nine in a row. And we are 7-0 in national TV and 4 on one original TV. Um, so it, it's pretty awesome to see. Uh, we're actually number six in the media polls, which I don't understand why we're not higher. But number six is pretty good for uh, for an ACC team. Uh, you, never, you rarely ever see that. Um, so we have no injuries. They have injuries. Uh, they're passing. Wow. They have good, uh, good leaders on passing. And uh, Casey Bryant's thrown for 23 interceptions on the year. That's just my bad. Um, but he's thrown for 26 touchdowns, which is exciting. Um, I'm actually kind of tempted to start Chuck Griffin instead of uh, of of Kenny Cole because, 
for one thing, he's a whole lot better of a running back, and I hope that he gets to stay with this program uh, after the offseason. I hope that he doesn't go to the uh, NFL draft. If he does, then I am going to talk him into staying because I need a back uh, bad. And our, our third string back is pretty good too. So as we advance to conference championship week, um, hopefully we get into the championship game. It would be really, really cool if we did. It would be a really good step because I don't think NC State's been in the championship game in probably 10 years. If even that, it may be even longer than that since they've been in the ACC championship game. I actually had a um, NC State a student come and uh, he he commented on one of the videos. So if you're watching this dude, uh, tell me when was the last time they were in the ACC championship game because I can't remember um, at all just based on the fact that uh, I just remember mainly being Georgia Tech and Virginia Tech or uh, Clemson in there every single year for the past nine years, eight, five, you know, just really, I guess the last decade has mainly been dominated by those three teams. But NC State's been good. You know, Phil Rivers was there for a long time. And he was good. So we are in the championship game. We are playing Virginia Tech. Uh, and we're going to be at home, which will be a tremendous game. That That's going to be awesome. So number nine versus number 10 for the ACC championship to get a berth into the Rose Bowl, hopefully. Um, that will be f- awesome. Um, so next time we will be facing the Hokies of Virginia Tech at home. We will probably be sporting the all red unis or we will red uh, or we will uh, wear, sorry, the red helmets with the white jerseys and the red pants like we did against FSU and we completely dominated them. Let's do this. Let's get it. Uh, let's go ahead and take the title of ACC Championship in to the Rose Bowl, hopefully against Houston. So next time, guys, we will take on the Hokies and see you guys next time. Bye.